Good morning and welcome to Overtime with Rebecca Ann Burns on Facebook Live. Here's our opportunity to share a little bit more, like maybe some of the things we talked about on the morning show this morning. And this is also our opportunity to throw Jay Allen under the bus. Um, it's a gentle bus, but it shouldn't be because I, I just want to read to you a text, a Facebook text message that Don, Don Burns and I got from Jay Allen yesterday. Okay, this is what it says. It's from Jay Allen. Friends, I could use your prayers right now. Monday night, I started having some severe pain in my upper abdomen. We got this yesterday. It got really bad around 11 that night until I was hooked up to an IV yesterday at noon with pain meds. The text goes on and we come to read that our own Jay Allen may need gallbladder surgery. And so I read this and I'm like, what? Who does this over a Facebook message? So I immediately call Jay Allen, doesn't answer. So then I text him. And by the way, Jay, if I would have had Kaylee's phone number and I think I should have it, I would have been blown her up. I, I ask him like, what in the world is going on? Why did you work this morning if you were in so much pain? I was furious and I think I had a good reason to be. You absolutely did. The other thing that adds to this is Jay Allen is working from home this week. So we haven't seen him face to face to see how he is feeling. We didn't know he was in pain. Rebecca's like, why didn't you take the day off if you're in that much pain? And then, well, we get to the rest of the story. Well, I was so clueless because she's like, how are you in so much pain? That's why you have PTO. Why didn't you take it? Does anybody else know? And, and I'm like, what in the world are you talking about? And so apparently- I'm getting ready, I'm getting ready to blow up our boss and be like, tell Jay Allen to go to the hospital. Give the man the day off. I swear, there was like 20 exclamation points. Half of it was capitalized. I mean, there. this was a serious message. My heart started beating. I'm like, gosh, who's sick? Like, who's her yeah. right now? So like, I, I, it took me like, like a few minutes before I was like, oh my goodness. So as much as I need to work on texting, Rebecca needs to work on contextualization. Okay, now keep in mind when you're texting, the order the text comes through is not always the same order in which the message was sent. No, it um, never is. You get the most recent first. And again, this is Facebook Messenger. Tell them what you did, Jay Allen. Tell the class okay. what you did. <laughs> tell the class. So we have this chain where we send ideas of what we want to talk about. And so this just kind of lets us be aligned on what we want to talk about on the show. And so I sent an update on Micah Tyler in a separate message. So I was like, Micah Tyler is not having the best week. For one, Micah is going through a rough time. His brother has cancer and is having surgery. And then now Micah Tyler posts that on his Facebook page. So all I did was say, Micah Tyler is not having the best time one message. The next message is exactly in a separate message. Oh. In a separate message. Yeah. So if you read the second message without reading the first, you might think I said that personally, but that's coming from Micah Tyler. So I can okay. understand that. I can understand why somebody might think I'm sick, but I was so puzzled until I found that out. So first of all, keep Micah Tyler in your prayers. Yeah, so he will be most likely having gallbladder removal surgery, and he has had a terrible time, and he's one of KCBI's most beloved artists. So please, please, please say a prayer for Micah, say a prayer for his family and for his brother as he continues cancer treatment. And then would you also consider praying for our own Jay Allen, that he would learn to summarize instead of just rip people's own words off verbatim and thus send his co hosts into a panicked frenzy all i'm asking i just gotta say this is like the prank idea of a lifetime i'm going to do this more often than not no no uh, i i i would suggest you not do it again Jay Allen. <laughs> that, that would be my suggestion but uh, i'm lucky i'm not in person let's just say that <laughs> i'd be getting yelled at in person Keep Micah Tyler in your prayers. And thank you for joining us on this episode of The Overtime Show.